Hi there everyone, if you are unable to install apps on Amazon Fire TV Stick like it keeps loading, download failed, stuck at downloading and more, then here in today's video I'll go ahead and show you some of the easy way to fix your problem. So let's get started. Well, so first thing first, you just go ahead and take your internet connection. To do that, you can take another device and connect with the same network. Here as you can see, we have connected with the same network, but it's working very fine. If your device is working fine, then let's move to the next process. So to do that, you just go ahead and grab your Fire TV remote and then press the home button first. In order to get back to your home page, just go ahead and navigate to the settings. And once the settings icon is highlighted, you need to go down from here and then go to the application and go down from here and you'll get to see the manage installed application and also you'll get to see your internal storage space. If you found that you are running out of storage, in case you need to free up some storage on your Fire TV. To do that, you can simply select this option and then press OK and here you'll get to see all the installed application on your Fire TV. So first thing first is go ahead and find out some of the unnecessary applications and you can follow two ways to free up some storage. The first one is you can clear cache your application or or you can uninstall some of the unnecessary application from your Fire TV. So for example, I'm just going to select this application, then go ahead and press OK and go down to the clear cache. Just go ahead and press OK. So if you found that the application is unnecessary to you, you just go ahead and uninstall the application from your Fire TV. And hopefully it will give you some of the free space and your problem is going to be solved. But if any case, if you see that you have available storage on your Fire TV, but you are still having the same problem, then follow the next process. In the next process, we need to update the Fire TV. Well, so now to update the Fire TV, you need to get back from here. And then from the settings, you need to go down to the My Fire TV option. And once the About is selected, press OK from here and go down to the bottom and you'll get to see the install update option. And if you see the update is available, just go ahead and update your Fire TV because sometime the painting update can cause the problem. Well, so once your Fire TV is up to date, you just go ahead and take your issue once again and hopefully this will resolve your problem. But if any case, if you see that you are still having the same problem, then the last and final things that I'm going to talk about is doing a factory reset on your Fire TV. Well, so to do that, you just go ahead and get back from here and then go to the settings once again and then go down to My Fire TV and go to the bottom. Once the reset to factory default is selected, just go ahead and press OK and then select reset. But make sure this process will remove all the information that you have included on your Fire TV so far. And it will have started resetting your Fire TV. So we need to wait for a while until this process is being completed. So once you're done with this process, just go ahead and set up your Fire TV once again. Once you're done with all of this process, hope that you will be able to install apps on your Fire TV. Hope you find this video helpful. If you do, drop a like and subscribe to the channel. See you in the next one and thank you very much for watching.